Hello my friends and welcome back to another video. It's been quite a while, it's been about two weeks and we are playing some ranked today. That's what we're doing, we're playing some TFT ranked games. Uh, I haven't uploaded in about two weeks, mainly because I've just been playing a whole lot of Elden Ring. As you can see, I have an Elden Ring sized beard that I've grown in all of my time playing. It's it's pretty hard. I'm sure you guys already know about that if you've ever played. But anyway, let's just get back to this TFT game. I have been playing here and there. I just haven't recorded any of my games. Like I said, this is a ranked game. I am plat 1, 41 LP right now. So I'll be very, very close to gold if I happen to win this game. So let's let's try and do that. Let's try and win this game. Uh, Bloodthirster, I love me some Darius action there. I'll leave him there. And this game is Radiant Blessing as the portal, which really sucks. I was trying to get all my recording stuff set up so I didn't even get to vote. This is not what I would have voted for though, but here it is. So we're just gonna make the best of it here. Now, I haven't really played enough to know what the meta is at the moment. I've heard that it's pretty diverse right now. After eight player combats, gain one training dummy with one permanently supported attached item, Thieves Gloves, or Pandoras. Hmm, I think I want Thieves Gloves. Thieves Gloves are just too good. Ooh, a bunch of these. Uh. I guess I'll give her the Thieves Gloves, and I'll have Darius hold some items for me. Now, is there anybody else I could play here? Hmm. Could go for three Story Weaver. Probably would like to do that. I guess this might be better. I'm not. I'm not a hundred percent certain, but I think that's probably. A decent start. I mean, that Darius just by himself will probably do a million damage. Oh, look, he's fighting a Darius as well. I'm just building those as Lee Sin items, really. All I need now is a Titan's Resolve, and I'll have some pretty good Lee Sin items. That was an easy win. Let's see what everybody else is going. Trick Shot Bruiser, classic. Behemoth. Arcanist guy doing the Lux build. I've seen that a couple times. Lux is kind of crazy right now. More Behemoth. More Bruiser Dryad. Bruiser. Lots of Bruiser. I guess we're all going Bruiser right now. Oh, a Diana. I love to see that. So Diana is actually really good here. If only I had a Zyra for Sage. Now, I don't quite have that yet, but I'm sure I'll get it soon enough. Hmm, Amumu's not really gonna do much for me. You know what, I kind of just like her. So I'm gonna put her in, sell that. Not gonna use him. I might use this Aatrox to have two Bruiser in. We'll see if I if I have to. So maybe I shouldn't have taken Darius out, he's kinda doing some damage. Oh? Dude, that's a crazy Kogma. Somebody stop him. Somebody stop him. Oh, yeah. That's good stuff right there. Kale's carrying. And so is Diana. Look at her do all that damage. It's pretty nice. Another Garen. I really want Zyra. But there is no Zyra to be had, unfortunately. I was kind of hoping I'd just get really lucky and high roll her. Not a great idea to roll down there, but it is what it is. This guy's trick shot warden. Ooh, this guy's got a strong board already. See, this is the main reason why I wanted Zyra. I wanted my board to be strong enough to beat somebody like this. We'll see though. Lots of story weavers. I guess I'm not the only one. Oh yeah, lots of story weaver. Look at this. This guy's just stealing my board, bro. Hopefully mine's just stronger than his is. It's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good for me. 
Nice. Hopefully he gets Elam right away so I can just take all his units. It's already hard enough to have to compete with everybody else. Mm, what do I want here? Probably want a bow. There it is. I want a bow for a Titan's Resolve for my Lee Sin later on. Come on, dude. Oh. Come on, dude. You know you want that sword. Come on. Let me, let me get that bow. Let me get that bow. Too slow. Nah, I don't think he was even going for it. You know, Ghostly would be pretty good, too. You know, I, I bet everybody feels like this. Like what I'm about to say. But don't you guys feel like every time that you're going for a comp, everybody's just suddenly going for that comp? Like, I kind of like Ghostly right now, and I would not be opposed to playing it, but I feel like the moment that I decide to go Ghostly, everybody else will just immediately decide to also go Ghostly. I kind of don't. I'm not about that, you know? I want to go Ghostly by myself. But I think nobody this game is actually going ghostly, so this would have been a really good game for it. It's just a little too late now. A little too late. Too little. Oh. Dude, Diana barely got that cast off there. She nearly died. I'm really glad she didn't. Nice. Oh, he's just picking up Dragon Lords to spite me, bro. See that? Just picking up those Janus. Dude, I feel like I'm gonna go against this guy. He already has a Lee Sin. I'm so jealous. I'm so freaking jealous, dude. How could you? Yeah, I'm so unfortunate, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna end up fighting this guy and it's gonna hurt. Well, we'll see. At least Riven has a Titan's Resolve on her. That'll uh, make her a little stronger. Oh yeah, I knew I'd be fighting this dude. My poor Diana. Oh, I should have definitely moved her out of there so she would have stood a chance. Oh, feels bad, man. This guy's insane. This guy's insane with this Lisa. And let me see how much damage. Yeah, I mean, that seems about right. Well, there's my win streak. He is level six. He's playing like I would play. Just super aggressive. Level up by every level. I mean, that's why you got that early Lee Sin. It's pretty lucky. No story weaver units, since everybody else is going it. This guy's Warden, Warden Ari. Arcanist, ghostly. Story weaver again. Oh, this sucks. Heavenly Duelist, classic, ghostly, and more ghostly. I guess a lot of people were going ghostly. Everybody can just read my mind. Gonna have to think of something fast. Uh, definitely don't need you. Whatever. A gauntlet. A single gauntlet. Amazing. Amazing item. I can't believe that's all that it gave me. That's, that's pretty sad. I so you start Garen. That counts for something, right? Really? Not a single... Not a single Zyra, huh? There we go. It seems just slightly better. Guess if I had a Zoe, I could put her in place of Sivir. And then I could play this for Arcanist Heavenly. All it's giving me right now is Warden. If I placed her in now, all it would give me is Heavenly, so. I'm not gonna go with that yet. Just gonna have to wait. Oh, yeah, at least my board is decent. My board's pretty strong, at least. Not stronger than that dude in first place, but it's pretty strong. It's, it's just that Lee Sin is just insane, man. He has an Ionic Spark on him. Uh, let me grab some water. Don't mind me. I'm just 
doing a long reach for some water so I can think better more clearly. Rolling for days. Let's just take it, man. There's a Zyra. Also this. Huh, okay, that's... That's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, that... That's pretty nice there. And then... Could do four... Five. Gets rid of quite a few units here. What should I put in next? Probably Soraka for Altruist, right? I mean, five story weaver's pretty good. That Kale back there should be doing a lots of damage. And I have a Galio, which is one of the best tanks in the game, so. He also just kind of popped everybody's immunity to CC there with one attack. That was awesome. Oh yeah, this makes my board a lot stronger. Rolling for days never expire. Okay, good. I wish there was a way to know how many rolls I had left. That'd be pretty useful here. Not yet. Not yet. Did I sell all this? Five? Three? It would give me more eco. I might have to sell all that. More HP, sure. I'll take that. I'll take that for sure. Should I sell all this stuff? I don't think I should. I think I should put in my Soraka next. Two star Nico feels just bad to sell. She's it's a pretty awesome unit. I love her. Yeah, I'll sell her. I'd probably rather have Soraka in there anyway. I just need to chill out though and kind of eco for a while. Just need to chill out, play some eco game, just calm down. Yeah, starting my units in the back row is a good idea. That extra HP goes a long way. <laughs> my poor Galio didn't stand a chance just getting targeted like that, but hey. That's what he's there, there for. He's just there to absorb damage while everybody else does some. No? Nice. Good. Good win streak going on. Oh, this guy is still insanely win streaking. It's like branching out. Just gave him a ward and spat. Okay, I would love to take that. Okay, well. He's got uh, maybe an item. I have a gauntlet. What, what do we even want here? I would have taken Annie just because it's an Annie, but it doesn't look like I'm going to get to. I'll take this just to make a Hajj if I have to. I don't know if I'm really going to make one yet. Maybe I should have gone for a defensive item for my Galio. That would have also been a really good choice. Star, Diana. Sell that for gold. Just gotta keep it going still. Who would I even roll down for a level 7 is the real question. <laughs> Aurelia? Probably not. Three more rounds remaining of the 200 HP. Who should I roll down for at level 7 though? Nobody? Maybe a 2 star Soraka. 2 star Riven would be good. But I think I would just use my free rerolls for that, and that's about it. Oh, this guy has pretty much a replica of my board. I have more items, I think, and seven story weaver. So maybe I'll win this. That was a huge KO ult. Dude, that Garen is kind of massive. Why does Theric Gauge work so well on him? Tanky or Garen, I don't think I've ever seen without the Augment. Okay, it should be alright though. I have a stronger Kale. Bigger Kale wins. Okay, that's really nice. It decided to give me that for free that way. 
so I wouldn't have to roll down at all. No two-star Zyra, which is kind of to be expected at this point, you know, since so many people are going Story Weaver units. Dude, is this guy about to knock me off my win streak again before the minion round? That would be so unfortunate. It would truly make me sad. Okay, what do we have here? Another Lux build. Except for this guy has a way. He's really going for that Lux 3 star. Uh, not the greatest positioning here. Actually, it's alright. She's not hitting tail, which is really good. I think I've gotten really lucky with getting two stars this game. Sometimes you just go all game without finding a two star, and it's really infuriating, but not this time. They're just kind of all being handed to me. Dude, I'm glad I didn't fight that guy in first, because whoever, oh, whoever fought him is really strong. Who did he fight? This guy right here, three ink shadow. He has a two star Kaisa. That's terrifying. Two star Zyra. Two more rounds of the extra HP. Maybe I'll do like this. That way Garen can go right away and Galio can get his cast off, give everybody a shield. Might be for the best. really need to build him some tank items if I can help it. Ooh, Zoe. Okay, I can go seven Story Weaver. It's very achievable. Seven Story Weaver is definitely achievable this game. But it's gonna be a little weird. Don't think I'm gonna roll down yet. What I think I should do is make some items for my Galio. I know these are really not optimal items for him, but he just needs some. He just needs a few tank items so he can last just a little bit longer. Oh, is this the really strong guy? Yeah, it sure is. And my Diana is really holding that Lee Sin down for now. Come on, Galio. Cast one more time, bro. Nice. Pop that shield on everybody. Dude, Redemption actually goes pretty hard on him. See how he's just, like, barely healing himself? Nice, dude. Not only that, but Riven got really lucky, and her Thieves' Gloves had Redemption as well. That worked out really nicely. Should have maybe picked up that Nautilus for level 8. Hmm, extra HP. Support item. Ooh, sorry, excuse me. <laughs> Support item, balance budget. Mm. I'm not too broke for gold, so I'm going to reroll that. Jeweled Lotus would be really nice here. I'm going to take the Jeweled Lotus just to do extra damage. Am I out of Yasuo rounds? I sure am. Alright, so I'll do something like this. There we go. Do something like this. That should be pretty good. Yeah, that should be pretty good. Even if a Lux is against me, I don't think she'll... The angle's just a little bit off. Dude, this guy has an Aurelia already. No wonder he won. He has a two-star Kaisa and an Aurelia. My poor Garen got absolutely melted away. Oh, my units want to live so badly, but so much damage coming out. Oh, wow. Riven, dude. Riven, <laughs> Riven and Kale kind of coming in clutch. Look at Riven's damage. She did a lot of damage for just the two star with two random items. Okay, so I could put Zoe. Zoe I'm just holding for when I get an Aurelia and I can play seven story Weaver. Jane is actually going in my on my board very soon. I think the play is definitely going seven story Weaver though. It could be pretty good. 
definitely would give Kale tons of more damage. If I can somehow make a story weaver spat, that's really the the most freely handed down to me ever. I don't think I want to roll down insanely until I'm level nine as well. I want to make sure I hit my two-star Aurelia. Ideally, though. Ideally, I am going for level 10 here. That's how we're really going to maximize gains on this board, is by being level 10. Level 9 is just not enough to fit everything in there. Okay, what do I want? I want another Titans. But maybe I should think about building some Aurelia items, so like a bow? Bow would go good either way. It's on a Lilia, though, so... Unlikely that I get that. If not that, then I guess I'd take the rod, just because part of a rage blade for Aurelia, but it, wow. I'm genuinely shocked that nobody took that Lilia right there. It's kind of crazy. She's a pretty in demand unit. You forgot to bow. Hmm. Gotta condense everything. Just take what I need so I can level up and make the most eco. Another Aurelia. Dude. Why? How are these people getting so lucky? I guess that guy is level 8 and he's rolled down quite a bit. He must be trying to stabilize his board. Fighting the guy in last place, but this guy has used everything that he possibly can in order to survive. He is only level 6, though, but, I mean, he has a lot of 3 stars. Oh? Ugh, dude. Poor Diana. Oh, sh Kale didn't get to blast her. <laughs> Kale was about to blast that freaking guy, and then she got ulted. Oh, man, my team has a lot of survivability on it, though, so... Rip. Rip my boy. Oh, dance. A dance of victory, sure. Dance of victory. Looks like most people in here are level 8. And then me and this guy are level 7. So I probably want to level up uh, to have a good, good odds. Let's see. I can afford a quick level up there. Give me some Dragon Lord bonus for my my team. Still don't want to roll down yet, though, do I? I just did one. One for the one time. Do that. Have a bow. And that. Okay, I guess I can build an item for Aurelia now. Rage Blade tends to be one of her best items, but I think Red Buff might be even better here. Oh. Oh, this guy's tanky just like I am. Come on. No, dude. No. If that kill would have blasted that guy, he would have died. He would have died. Had he been blasted by Kale. can almost go level 9, which would be Forsaken going level 10, but it would be going level 9, so I think I definitely want to do that. I'm going to have that Jaina hold my items for now, and then I'm going to put Galio's best item on him. Oh, he died too fast. Oh, I didn't see this bow here. I don't know if I should put that on him then. Another Titan's Resolve for my soon-to-be-had Lee Sin. I'm gonna level up. I'm gonna go 9. I'm losing, and I will continue to lose, unless I go level 9 real fast. 
another five toss. Heart is empty without empathy. All right. I'm just gonna have him chill there. I mean, I really don't want this dude here. <laughs> okay, let me do this. For the Titans. There we go. I do have reforgers, but I don't think I want to use that on anything. I'm just trying to get that two-star Aurelia now. Uh, maybe the level 9 boost will allow me to beat this guy here. Ah, oh, dude, Aurelia is just so insane. She's just so insane. He actually has really good items on her, too, so... It is no joke with that guy and his Aurelia. I will not falter. Okay, so there is a way to put Lee Sin in here. Give him what I think his best item combination is, which would be that. All I need to do is find a freaking Aurelia so I can get 7-story Weaver in, and that's it. I'm gonna sell my Huey, put it, put her in there, and then I guess I would take out... Soraka, probably? Yeah, I think Soraka's gonna be the one that's gonna be taken out later. All I know is that I really need to hit 7-story Weaver for that boost on Kale. Yikes. This guy ended up selling his Lee Sin, I think. He went to whatever this comp is. I've seen it a lot, but I have no idea what comp that is. Heavenly Spatula. I mean, that would help now, but I don't think it would help in the long run. Oh, uh, dude, I was going to take that emblem right there. I'm gonna take the Heavenly Spatula because I can reforge it whenever I'm done with it. But right now, it will be useful, I think. Oh, why is my thingy falling off? I did not tighten this properly. Yeah, we'll just take it out for now. I'm sure you guys can hear me pretty well either way. Maybe I'm a little louder now, if anything. Aurelia. Empty without empathy. Why are you so hard to find right now, dude? Tactician's Crown. Oh, that's my Radiant Blessing finally came through. Okay, I mean, that's actually kind of awesome. Too bad I don't really have anyone to put in there at the moment. I think that's fine, though. Just one more Story Weaver, dude. That's all I need. Maybe I can, uh, nah, I, I should, I might as well just take the three-star gear that I'm about to get. Wow, so unlucky. Five loss streak. How far are we fallen? There's Aurelia, finally. Um, Legends are told in word so for one, this... I do have the seven right there. Uh, should I sell this? Another heavenly. Should I give the Omni Vamp too? There, I put it on her. On her. Okay, hopefully seven Story Weaver is enough to actually do a lot of damage here. Okay, that wasn't bad. Got through his front line rather fast. Please, please blast them. Oh my god, she's one shot. <laughs> oh, that was so close. That was so close. I would have been pretty mad if I'd lost that one. I'm not gonna lie. Especially after hitting seven story weaver. Being higher level than that guy. I'm just trying to get a top four right here. Did ruin my chances at three starring Garen. That's fine. Didn't ruin them entirely. Now, I don't know if Huey would be better there. There's a lot of Luxes going around. Let's see how many. 
There's one right there. He's not positioned properly, though. And that's it. Looks like there's just one. So, you know what? That might not be too bad to put him right there. He's got a two-star Aurelia now. Two-star Aurelia would make my board absolutely insane. And so would a two-star Lee Sin, because he has such good items on him. I'll try to just get that. Two-star Lee Sin. An Aurelia item here. Another Thieves Lips. Asher's too. I'm gonna take the thieves' gloves and put it on him. Wouldn't wish my fate on anybody. Come on, dude. Where's all the, where's all the Aurelias? I don't know where they are. Pretty hard to find, honestly. Dragon Lord Altruist. Who would I put him in place of? Diana? That would take away Sage, though. Too bad I don't have a Story Weaver spat. It's a little unfortunate. Oh, come on! Oh, okay. No! No! I hate this guy. I freaking hate this guy. How is this one star away doing that much damage, dude? I don't understand. Oh, I guess he has three I items on him. Wukong. Hmm. I don't know if... Three Sage Heavenly? No, it's a two-star way, man. There's no way that that's better, right? Yeah, I hope that works. Depends on who I'm fighting, I guess. This guy's pretty strong. He's going the good old sniper build. Boy has really good items on him though, so maybe he'll do some real damage this time. I also really need that two-star lead. Come on, you can win this. You can win it! Oh. She takes so long to cast. Cast! Oh my god, friggin' Ash is a monster. Who got destroyed. <laughs> and I, you love that guy. <laughs> that was close. Okay, top four. Top four is sick. That's what we're shooting for. And I guess I could put this tactician's crown on somebody. Oh, uh, you know, Heavenly doesn't do anything now, does it? He forged it twice, and nothing. Nothing good. Oh, there's two Galios. I mean, two Galios is pretty nice. Those are such bad items on the way, though. Tank items. Might as well just put them in, in the front there. Okay, as long as my kill doesn't get hit by that, we stand a chance. Oh, yeah, that's good stuff right there. But, dude, that's a tanky ass. Illawi. No, we almost even had this guy. Well, that's a GG. Fourth place. Not bad.